Greetings in the name of Jesus Christ. Today's thought is from Psalm 32 verse 8, second part of the verse, but I will read the full verse for you. I will instruct you and teach you in the way you should go. I will guide you with my eye. The second part of the verse says, I will guide you with my eye. When God helps us to walk in his ways, always his eyes will be upon us. Why he wants to keep his eyes upon us? Here the Bible says to guide us. And also, Bible says to protect us. When the children of God delivered from the land of Egypt, God started to lead them. When God led them, Bible says, the Lord always kept his eyes upon his people and protect them. Many enemies were there, but God never delivered his people in the hands of the enemies. Instead, God gave the enemies in their hands. They took victory over the enemies. Always God was, God was watching over them. In your life also, his eyes, his eyes are upon you. He is watching over you. When you walk in his ways, he will guide you with his eye. He knows how to guide you. He knows how to protect you. You are under the guidance of God. He is the one guiding your life by keeping his eyes upon you. So he is able to protect you. He will never deliver you in the hands of the enemy. Shall we do a word of prayer? Let's pray. Lord Jesus, thank you for watching over us. Thank you for helping us by keeping your eye upon us, O God. Lord Jesus, we worship you. We love you, Lord. Let this day be a day of blessing for your children. Encourage them. Lord, you will never deliver us in the hands of the enemies. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. We need your divine protection. Thank you for watching over us, O God. Let your hand be upon your children. Bless them abundantly. Let your presence guide them, Lord. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. God bless you. The Lord will guide you. Amen.